Hey, Caitlin. You know what we need? What? Another computer. It says so right here. I did the math. I don't have a problem. I don't have a problem. This video is brought to you by Squarespace, the all-in-one platform for all your website needs. But you guys know we're just not gonna be buying a normal computer case. That's not what we do on this channel. We want something that says Evan and Caitlin, that really speaks to who we are. So of course, we are gonna be doing wood and resin. We even have a prototype right here instead of a 3D model. Let's see if I can rotate it nicely. Does that look nice? Yeah. So we are partnering with Artesian Builds to build this. So they have sent us this metal frame. They're gonna be assembling the electronics later. We get to build the casing around it. So the very first step of this whole process is gonna be finding interesting wood that will blend well with resin because we just don't want to slap like a two by four on the side of this. No, I want interesting edges. I want crevices. Crevices, I want, people. I want some interest. Why is, the, why, are, why is the word crevice weird? Because you think of butt cracks. Oh, yeah. I mean, maybe other crevices too. So we set off to find wood with interesting cracks, crevices, or edges. Ooh, that's the nice. fancy stuff. Yeah. But we needed small pieces, no more than half an inch thick, and usually live edge wood is much thicker. <laughs> <laughs> Luckily, after much searching, don't do that. We found some mesquite with really interesting cracks in it. Perfect for filling with resin. So there are some great parts in great each of these. Cracks. Great crevices. 10 out of 10 crevices. This one, that one's my favorite crevice. Yeah. So we've finalized our placements for maximum crack exposure. Ooh, giving them a little sneak peek. <laughs> <laughs> sneak peek, it's my crack. <laughs> and the next step is to fill these cracks with resin before we carve them into these individual shapes. But we need to do an experiment first. We have learned the hard way. You don't just jump to the final thing. Because yes, we have some great cracks here, but we might want to add some more cracks too. And maybe even enlarge our crevices. Maybe enlarge our cracks and crevices. <laughs> Are we gonna be doing this like the whole time? Um, so what we have to decide now is natural crevices only or artificial crevices too. Which way is it gonna spit? It spits that way. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a little nervous, it's been a while since we did this. Ooh. It's kind of scary how buttery smooth that is. Yeah, it like eats away at it like nothing. I know. So I tried a couple different sizes of cracks. Now I'm gonna go in and clean the up these bad boys. How did? How is it like? I can feel it poking me through the shirt. Is it in my shirt? It's in my pockets. <laughs> Looks great. Was I was I recording any of that? No. Well, you can show them now, I guess. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. I'll do I'll do that after tour. It was it was some good carving. Right. I got some nice uh, tapered corners. You know, I can record you trying it, and we'll uh, <laughs> we'll have that at least. I'm gonna go for a staggered crack. Yeah, that one, oh. Right, it's everywhere now, instantly. Oh, it's in your beard. It's part of me. Cool. Let's uh, bust out the resin and do some tests. Resin time. Resin time, resin time. Do, 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 resin time. So, we are using fast cure resin today, so we have 10 minutes to get everything mixed and in place. We're gonna try for like a tealy type color, kind of like we have on our ocean resins. Oh yes. Yes, my pigments. Yeah, and it's fully opaque in there, that's good. If we find ourselves struggling with time, we could probably be a lot less precise. All right, let's fill one of the natural ones. This one we might need to just pour. It's a big crack. Yeah, that was smart. That was very smart, Caitlin. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, this works really well, actually. That's looking like it's solidifying fairly well uh -huh. right there. Oh, 
Okay, can I have some coffee? <laughs> I'm not gonna spill it on myself this time. <laughs> so, it's the next day. The last time we sanded off a big chunk of resin mixed with wood, it was our LED resin table, and we used this. I went a little bit extra with this at various points, and the entire surface still haunts me to this day a little bit, because it has a little bit of like... Some natural wave. Yeah, not all of our keyboards sit perfectly flat. So instead of hand sanding it, I thought it'd be good to bust out our planer that we haven't used in... One year. Yeah. All right, time for loud machinery. Wow. Hey, okay, I think that's it. Everything looks really good. So my initial observation is that, you know, my eye goes to the ones we made. The existing ones, I kind of barely even see. I think that if we didn't do it, uh, there's just a strong possibility that we'll regret not doing more. And if we mess it up, maybe we can just keep on adding more until it looks good. Ready? Mm. So we got our initial cracks carved, and then we decided that we want to take it a little bit more extreme. We're actually going to try to do our own faux live edge on the tops of three of these pieces. So you can see where we're going to carve out. Now this is, uh, this is going to be a lot of resin. I feel like if we're going to be calling this a resin and wood computer case, we need some more resin. This is going to be a lot of carving. All right, ready? Okay, go for it. I'm so glad that you had the idea to add some like really large areas of resin. Yeah, it, it's kind of hard to picture the final thing, but I mean, we, what we did is add more resin, so I can't imagine it would be bad. This is gonna be so fun. You like the color? I like it. Yeah, I think it's pretty cool. Are you ready to spread the jam? Mmm. Atomic jam. Atomic jam. Ooh. Why is that so satisfying? It's kind of nice just being able to be messy with resin. Yeah, we're gonna clean it all up later. Alright, now every little area has at least some resin in it. I think I actually want to leave it here, let this settle and come back for another coat later. So we don't make it too thick and end up smoking it? Don't want to smoke it. And I kind of want the wood to soak it up. Give it some time to like... Yeah, we'll go have a snack. Waffles? <laughs> we'll go have waffles as a snack. <laughs> so look at how much our first batch soaked in. Isn't that crazy? It's like we didn't even resin these cracks. Caitlin. Yeah? I have the most severe case of like mask beard ever. <laughs> oh it's no. Like, there's a little shelf right there. That means that all of this is just a big puff. Baby, that's a look. Boop. Three rounds of resining later. It's not sinking in anymore. There's no exposed crevices. And it is very interesting. If you look at how the resin settled, you can actually see where the cracks are underneath the resin, even yeah. though it's flat. It like Powder. slurped the pigment. We're gonna have to wait until this fully hardens because we don't want to be... Yeah. <laughs> We don't want to be cutting off uncured, not, not fully cured resin. Yeah. I think I would have, I thought I would have gotten better at words by now. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Is the talent here yet? She was supposed to be here an hour ago. I don't know what's going on. The talent is here. Did you get ham for her as per my request? She requires ham after every photo. Want ham? It's 
the grand debut of Jude's new website, supervisor.com, built using our sponsor, Squarespace, of course. And you have 45 seconds till this talent needs a nap. Go! Squarespace is a one-stop shop for websites, whether you're selling a product or sharing your portfolio. Yes, work it, darling, work it. Building supervisor.com with Squarespace was really intuitive using their templates, and it works on mobile too. Juve, more regal, like this. Plus, with Squarespace, you can even purchase domains, use e-commerce tools, and schedule appointments. The talent needs a handbrake. Give me that! So head to squarespace.com for a free trial, and when you're ready to launch, go to squarespace.com slash Evan and Caitlin for 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. Boop. So, <laughs> it wasn't going through the planer. We realized there was sticky residue on the back. We're baby powdering the wood. <laughs> I don't know. They that look really great. so cool. I know. I love how it has its own unique little pattern in each one. <laughs> I'm just, I'm so relieved that it looks okay because we really didn't know if our artificial cracks would look nice or not, but I think it looks cool. I, I think, think it, it looks, looks really natural. cool. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. That looks like a live edge. All right. Let's, uh, <laughs> hope we don't mess up this CNC segment coming up. <laughs> no pressure. so worried look how close it is to the edge of our resin yeah. pool. Let's carve the rest. After the CNC we routed in a ledge for our glass top to sit on. And then came the polishing. Evan how was the polishing? Uh <laughs> it was long. <laughs> have been editing. I want to check in on him. Hey, Pepe. How you doing? <laughs> Did, okay. <laughs> I think that might be a sign. It's a joke. <laughs> Do you want to see something cool? Yes. There's a, a spare test piece that I polished. So this is the original. Oh yeah, by the way, look at that. Oh. That piece is amazing. That's the front. Uh, yes. That looks so good. Well, look at that sheen. It looks I'd, I'd look at that and say it's perfect, it's good to go, it's polished, mm -hmm. but look at that and how glossy oh, that is. Oh. That way right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For something that we're gonna have for so long that we've put already so much effort into, mm -hmm. figured we should probably go the extra mile even though it's like, oh, we need to ship this out tomorrow. This daylight savings time. It's only 10.15 at night. <laughs> and only, we only have to finish all of these by tomorrow. But it just looks so shiny. It's so shiny. <laughs> it's so shiny. So, what, what, what do you come out here for? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like there's a point every few projects where we just like stare at the project we've done. We're like, this is the prettiest, best thing we've ever done. And it's not even done yet. That Look is it. so dang pretty. Look at how shiny this resin is. The polishing we did for the resin kind of carried over to the wood too. It's so and soft. And this is the softest, most velvety smooth wood I have ever felt. But we only have uh, three hours before we have to ship this out. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going with a really fast finishing method. Wood oil. <laughs> this isn't something that's gonna be subject to lots of wear and tear. We're gonna no. put it in place and it will stay there and no one's allowed to touch it. So I think it'll be fine. I think we're allowed to like pet we're it allowed a, to. a little bit. All right, Caitlin, you wanna do the initial oil? <laughs> Are you ready? Do you need a little bit more time? No, I'm ready. <laughs> well, give, give that a little shaky shake to mix all the components. Oh yeah. <laughs> what? Why are you making this creepy? Because I'm gonna put sexy music behind it. <laughs> I feel uncomfortable. Oh, BB is gonna be so nice. Oh. Wow, that makes such a huge color difference.
Okay. Are you nervous? I'm a little nervous about drilling into the pretty wood. Everything so far has worked well. If we mess it up now... Yes? We won't. <laughs> We're on the right side, right? Okay. What if I crack it open and we have to go back to the resin? Nope. Scrapping the project. Not happening. Bingo, bingo. Oh, all right, so we happen to have this box we made like a year or two ago, and it just so happens to fit the computer case we just made. I don't want to ship anything in flimsy cardboard. Is this, this overkill? Maybe. Do we care? We care about our computer. All right, let's pack it up. Bon voyage. Safe travels. Safe travels. Mon ami. Mm. <laughs> you know it's tight when your bubble wrap is popping. All right, that's nice. Okay. It's time to send him off. To get his electronics added. It seems like it's been such a long time coming. It has been. <laughs> Artesian builds take care of our boy. <laughs> Amazing. Amazing. Some pretty freaking special experience. So after this build on the table, we're gonna crack into the resume. <laughs> <laughs> Is it intact? Is it intact? Wow. Oh. It's, there's it's, much more uh, stuff than when we last saw this. All right, I have the computer right here. Let's get this plugged in so we can see all that RGB. I know. Here, you, don't you, don't, here, let me, let me move it, let me move it. You hold on to this. Ah. <laughs> Use two hands. <laughs> we just spent so long on this. Artesian Bills has pulled an all-nighter to get this back to us on time. It's looking good. Hey, Jube, you want to come see? There's, there's a uh, tape. Jube, there's tape. <gasps> this is your favorite. Do you like? Yes. Oh my God. Jube, are you as excited as we are? I like tape. That looks so fancy. Oh, the guts. Oh, oh, the look glorious at those, guts. Look at those cables. Look at those heat vents. Oh God. Oh, oh man. Look at the heat sink on that boy. And now what everyone has been waiting for, time to bring on the RGB, which is over here somewhere. There it is. Oh. 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 I want to get over to this side right here oh. so I can see the front and the RGBs. Oh, oh. and with the glass, with our logo on it. It feels. Glorious. It looks glorious. Feels glorious. <laughs> she say feels glorious twice. Oh, I, I guess once I was feeling with my hand and once with my face. Yeah. Yeah. If you want to check out Artesian Build's actual build of this computer, we're going to have a link below to their video as well as their website if you want more info on them. And because we know people will ask in the comments, we're going to put the specs on the screen. So get ready to pause. Three, two, one. And since this is now the most powerful computer we own, it's one of a kind, it's our aesthetic, it's beautiful, who gets to have it, Caitlin? We only have one! Wait, wait, wait. are we going on shoot? Rock, yeah. paper, scissors, sh shoot? Yeah, shoot. Two out of three? Yeah. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh! Two, it's two out of three, it's two out of three. Wait, I'm not ready. <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. No, you don't get to cut, this is, we both did scissors, you have to act like you win. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot, rock, paper, scissors, shoot. 
Oh no! <laughs> okay, <laughs> it all comes down to this. <laughs> I'm hitting my hand so hard. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh! Yes! It's mine! It's 